Chapter 2 When you bring a grain offering to the Lord, the offering must consist of choice flour. You are to pour olive oil on it and sprinkle it with incense. Bring this offering to one of Aaron's sons, and he will take a handful of the flour mixed with olive oil, together with all the incense, and burn this token portion on the altar fire. It is an offering made by fire, very pleasing to the Lord. The rest of the flour will be given to Aaron and his sons. It will be considered a most holy part of the offerings given to the Lord by fire. When you present some kind of baked bread as a grain offering, it must be made of choice flour mixed with olive oil but without any yeast. It may be presented in the form of cakes mixed with olive oil or wafers spread with olive oil. If your grain offering is cooked on a griddle, it must be made of choice flour and olive oil, and it must contain no yeast. Break it into pieces and pour oil on it. It is a kind of grain offering. If your offering is prepared in a pan, it also must be made of choice flour and olive oil. No matter how a grain offering has been prepared before being offered to the Lord, bring it to the priests who will present it at the altar. The priest will take a token portion of the grain offering and burn it on the altar as an offering made by fire, and it will be very pleasing to the Lord. The rest of the grain offering will be given to Aaron and his sons as their food. It will be considered a most holy part of the offerings given to the Lord by fire. Do not use yeast in any of the grain offerings you present to the Lord, because no yeast or honey may be burned as an offering to the Lord by fire. You may add yeast and honey to the offerings presented at harvest time, but these must never be burned on the altar as an offering pleasing to the Lord. Season all your grain offerings with salt to remind you of God's covenant. Never forget to add salt to your grain offerings. If you present a grain offering to the Lord from the first portion of your harvest, bring kernels of new grain that have been roasted on a fire. Since it is a grain offering, put olive oil on it and sprinkle it with incense. The priests will take a token portion of the roasted grain mixed with olive oil, together with all the incense, and burn it as an offering given to the Lord by fire.